Hey, what's up guys, it's Del Vinci, and I'm back on YouTube, and today I'm doing a tutorial on how to make an Isaiah Rashad type beat. He's dropping his album, The House is Burned, tonight. I've been super excited to hear his album for a long time now, uh, so I just wanted to celebrate the release by making a beat and a tutorial on how to make a type beat. <laughs> so I'm gonna get into this. Okay, so... Okay, so just wanted to check that we're recording, so we're all good. So what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna start out with an electric piano, uh, I have stage 73 right here. This is an, an Alteria plugin. I have a cassette on here to give it like some cool, like wobbly effect. I also have a RC20 to put some reverb on. Uh, so I'm gonna just start out. I think I'm gonna start out like 135. Uh, so typically with a lot of Isaiah Rashad type beats, as I hear, it's usually a lot like mostly black keys. Usually like D sharp minor, A sharp minor, C sharp minor. It's usually a lot more like darker type vibes, but like soulful, but like the dark soulful, if you know what I mean. Yeah, so what I did, I actually got a drum loop from my homie Jacob Rochester. He's super dope. He's the homie. Uh, he's super amazing, talented producer. But uh, I use his drum loops a lot because he sends me them and they're fucking fire. So I always click up with them. <laughs> but yeah, so I have, these are the drums I have right here. Uh, let me Just like some smooth, kind of like soulful boom bap type shit. And I have these electric, this electric piano pulled up. So I'm gonna play some chords. Uh, I'm gonna be playing like A sharp minor to D or G or A flat major. I'm not really too good at like describing what chords I play. I don't really know like the names of certain chords, which is bad. I need to learn them. But yeah, so I'm gonna start this off right now. So check this out. Okay, so we got that. Um, okay. Mm. I might take out this right here. Uh, let me take that out. Is this on? Hold on. Oh yeah, we're on. Okay. So I really like this little loop I got here going so far. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna add a bass guitar. Where, so I don't know if you guys saw that with the camera because um, it's a lower note. But uh, yeah, so this is what I played right here. Okay. Okay, so something I noticed in a lot of like TDE type music is like they be taking like 3 6 Mafia acapellas and cutting them up and putting them in the beat. So that's what I did right here. I found this 3 6 Mafia acapella. Um, it's called Weak Ass Bitch. So <laughs> I just cut it up and put it in. But this is how it sounds. And I, it's still not perfect. I gotta cut it up more, but check it out. <laughs> play that I kind of messed up So that's 
pretty fire right there. So next, I'm gonna add a guitar. Solo kinda, but I couldn't do it on camera because I have to switch my audio interface settings around to play the guitar and I can't use my audio interface when I record an OBS, but this is my guitar right here and this is what I just uh, recorded. <laughs> Yeah, so that's the guitar uh, I recorded. I just did it in one take. It's not the best, but it's just, this is just a quick YouTube video. So I'll probably like redo it later on. Um, but I'm just running the guitar through a guitar rig six right here. Uh, it's not loaded. Okay, yeah, just some just a little amp, some delay in the flanger slash chorus, and then just some reverb. Uh, <laughs> So now I think next I'll do a little drum switch up because usually these type of songs start with like some nice smooth drums then there's a little switch up into like some harder types of it. So yeah, so let me loop this part right here. Um, I'm going to be using the Da Vinci Drum Kit Volume 2. If you guys don't know, I have three kits out. They come with loops, drums, all sorts of stuff. Link in bio. But um, oh, hold on. Someone's calling me. Um, I had over that too. Yeah, so I got the kick now too. This is just the basic kick right here. Um. Now I actually think for this part I'll actually use a an 808. Uh, I guess I'll use this 808 right here, the Da Vinci 808 one. Let me just tune it really quick and get my baseline. Put that over. Oops, my bad. All right, got this right here. Bring that up. All right, awesome. I'm gonna take that. Split that. We got. Uh, hold on. Got this, and we'll just do that, and then cut that out. Alright, awesome. Let's see how it all sounds together right now. Hey. <laughs> I kind of messed up. My bad. <laughs> I'll play the whole thing from the beginning. Tag in there too. Hey. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, so I guess this is the whole beat, guys. Uh, you know, it's not completely finished. I'm gonna go back to it and polish it up a little more, redo the guitar, mix it and everything. But I just wanted to show you guys kind of how to make a, an Isaiah Rashad style beat in celebration of his new album dropping tonight. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope it was helpful. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. I'm, I'd love to answer. But yeah, guys, I appreciate you tuning into the video. If you guys like this content, please subscribe. It would help out so much. But hey, I hope y'all have. I hope all y'all are having a good day. Um, stay up. Peace.